This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. On this Wednesday, the 28th of June, we're looking at the Dow on this 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow's down 125 at 33,800. We're looking at a really nice move yesterday. I was expecting that we're from that little doji candle from three, three sessions ago that we should have an arch formation. And that's where the big test comes. Do we have an arch formation where we make a leg E, maybe a peak, a leg A, peak A, maybe even a B, but then we come back and we take out the left side low of um, 33,610. That's on the Dow. The S&P, same thing. S&P's got a lot better chart pattern and a very nice move up yesterday. It's down 11 at uh, 4366. And same thing. This is a trough A. This is a leg A, just a gray leg A, because the technicals are still quite weak. But that 9 is so strong about the 14. That's what's giving you some support here. It doesn't mean to say you can go to a new recovery high. It just says that the downside has to be pro proven by a lot of very negative, um, maybe it's action or negative comments or economic news. Uh, the index 100, that's the QQQ, down 55 at 363.25, holding very well. That nine-period moving average, if you look at the, the way it's starting to narrow, um, that says it's really good action, but it's starting to narrow between the nine and the 14-period moving average. The IWM, the Russell 2000, nice move up nine cents today, 183.42. Every time we think that the small caps are perhaps going to lead the way as the market takes a bit of a breather, oh, those small caps suddenly take a dive. And we'll see whether or not this is the same case. Meantime, gold uh, had a very, very nice, let me just get back, attempt yesterday to rally, but then it failed under the 200 period moving average. Now it's even lower. It's down uh, six at 1917. Uh, this is going to be very important because we'll be getting to the low of the candle. I'll talk about it in my show coming up, the Tiger Ignition's Hour. The week of the 17th of March, 1911 was the low. Uh, if we close under that, then you've got to start looking at the next level of support. Meantime, crude oil. Crude oil is down and bonds are, bonds are up a little bit. I'll be back in a moment for the Tiger Ignition's Hour. Check out my opening call, daily newsletter.